Hello, welcome back to Stardew Valley. I have a question for you all. Do you ever find it that you forget what you're working on? Like you're trying to make a certain machine or buy a certain building and then you go offline because you have to go to bed or work or school and then you come back and completely forget what you were doing. I do. And I have a solution for you. This mod, um, because if you're doing a mod, adds an ability to write your own diary. And before I show you it, I just want to point out, I've just noticed the really cute face on the end of this bed. Anyway, but yeah, so at the moment it's configured, so you click S5 and this will pop up. It allows you to go back through your days and yeah, so you can see what you've written on each day. You can even go from season to season and export it for something else. I'm not quite sure what it was to do with, but you just go on and then you can write anything. Anything you want. You could let you know that you what you need to get ready for the um, harvest festival. You know, like one cabbage, twenty one virgins, something like that. Um, whatever you want. But yeah, I think it, this is a really cute tool. I, I'm kind of. Wish this we had this in the game without mods because it's just something so simple. Now, not many games had, had, have, get the right term. Um, so it just adds that little extra help for you because last thing you want to be doing is logging off for the day, going to bed just before you leave, and coming back. 24 hours or a couple of days later, you never know. I don't know how often people come on. And can't remember what you're working on. But I like the fact that you can read back on the day. Sadly, I haven't written anything on these two days. And I don't think I can edit them. Oh, I. Apparently, I can. So you could make a tick list that you just remove once you get it. Um, I um yeah, but I so say you can export it into a text file, so you can have it um on your desktop rather than having it in game. But yeah, it's just a cute way to think, ensure that any ideas or plans you have, you can write down, and I think it's really cute because. Why else why wouldn't you want one? It's just, it's say it's it looks really useful, looks really cute. I think there's a couple of other mods that do stuff similar, but I'm only going to link down the mod I've used in the description. This video is kind of quick because I was trying to record other ones and the mod didn't work, but yay, this one did. Uh, I don't know if I mentioned it, you have to do F5 to get into it and to get out. Picking escape doesn't work at the moment. And I I might just be blind, but I didn't see a... Um, there's no X and nothing else, does it? You can't see, but I'm clicking escape, it doesn't work. Obviously, if you click anything else, it just activates. The keyboard. Yeah. But anyway. So that's this. This is just a quick mod that adds in a diary. It's called the Dear Diary Mod. I'll link that down in the description as always. Don't know if you guys just heard that. That was obnoxious. Anyway, that's that's it for me. That's just it. It was not going to take long to look over it. Um, yeah, so thank you for watching. Like if you like, comment if you can. Subscribe if you want. Do the important things, which is tell me I'm awesome if you think I'm awesome. Tell me I'm terrible if you think I'm terrible. 
Um, these are actually important to me, so please do. Check out my other videos. I do some Minecraft videos and I have tons of Stardew Valley mod reviews. Um, so if you guys are looking for a, another mod to add into your collection, please feel free to check those out. Anyway, this is Missy signing off. Good. Bye.